Thank you. Well, Espen, I don't know you. <laughs> Everyone speaks highly of you, so I got to know a little bit about you today. That was awesome. I can tell that your filler is, um, just a little bit. It wasn't too bad. Mine's so, and it happens a lot. I think you might like skiing just a little bit. <laughs> I notice that your strong points are that you're very confident just within yourself and speaking and that you, you, when you're standing up here, you give off a professionalism and you articulate your words very well. So those are great things to start back with. I don't know if you're like that when you first started. Um, one of the questions is how well did we get to know the speaker? Like I said, I didn't know you before. So what I learned was that you like skiing, you're married, owned a business, traveled, built a cabin, and now you're about to have 15 minutes of fame. Awesome. <laughs> There's a lot that I still don't know about you. I don't know if you have any kids. I don't know what the business was. I don't know why you sold it. I don't know if you're really going to be fulfilled skiing and not working. And there's a lot of questions I have now. <laughs> but I guess we've just hit the icebreaker. <laughs> So, were you, did, were you, did you prep adequately for this? I think your thoughts were prepped very well. The flow of it, I think, could have been more consistent. There was um, pauses, and you handled that well by not using fillers, and you stopped and, and gathered yourself. Um, maybe with more practice, I could tell maybe that you didn't practice a lot on it, but maybe if you practiced more, it would have flown nicer. Um, and of course, as I mentioned, your strong point was speaking clear. And then the other question was more how, I'm sorry, um, was your speech, let me go back to it. Oh, did the speech have a definite opening, body, and conclusion? So I was a little lost on this part because when I sat and listened to you, oh, when I sat and listened, I wasn't sure if your speech, your goal, was to tell us about what you've been doing the last couple of years, or was it about your obsession with skiing, or was it about how you, you built a cabin and you got to be on HGTV, or was it about all the silicone that you saw in Utah? <laughs> <laughs> so I personally would have liked to see a more clear like this is what I want them to know and then add all these little things in that tie to it instead of a bunch of little things about what you've done over the last few years. So that would just be my suggestion to you. But welcome back. Thank you.